Hi everyone, we are back. Brian and Christine Toon giving you an update on this year's Race Across America. We have just made it back from Decatur. Busy lacrosse weekend. Annalise playing lacrosse uh, up in Decatur, Alabama. And so we're giving a late update tonight. Um, interesting, at the front of the race, Pierre Bischoff is still plugging away you can see here his sleeps are just so minimal that's how he put uh, Mark Pattison oh and I said he was American but he's actually British um, not American uh, Dave Haas is now back in the lead for the Americans um, but in any case the he was got it to within like 20 miles or so here but you can see that Pierre slept for a, a little bit of time, but Mark slept even longer. And now he's kind of um, keeping him in his sights. But they're about 50 miles apart right now. Dave Haas, just phenomenal. Um, after this long period here, he's this um, tan colored. Uh, time they spent in the hospital and, and in a hotel um, and now he is catching up and passing people so every time you see him cross a line here he is passing people and uh, his angle if you follow his angle up he's got potential if he can hold it to the end to get back into that top three I think Marco below is doing really well it looks like he's just finishing off a sleep stop there Give a big shout out to Eric. Let me switch over to the 50 to 59. My friend Eric Newsholm is doing absolutely phenomenal. It's 1,400 miles in. He said goodbye to Colorado, which means he is somewhere in Kansas right now. Thank you. And, um, it's kind of crazy. They just keep riding. Yeah. Yeah, it is, it is crazy to think about that while we've been sleeping or whatever we've been doing, I've been riding a ton this weekend too, but um, while, while we've been doing whatever we're doing, they're out there riding, which is just incredible. There's, there's Eric. He's in 24th overall. Um, not bad, considering there's like 70-something people, I think, started this year. And um, in the 50 to 59 category, He's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ninth. Ninth right now. So good job, Eric. Keep on, man. Oh, here's to hoping the refers and tailwinds. I took a picture. If you if your crew happens to play you this video or anything, I took a picture for you of I-65 um, here in Birmingham. Uh, but that was a big deal for me when I crossed I-65 in Indiana. So you are well on your way to there. Um, keep on, man. Keep on keeping on. And um the other news to report is Michael Conti is out after his crew got hit by an 18-wheeler. So they, they were in direct follow, and the 18-wheeler, I guess, didn't see him in time or something, and just plowed right into the back of the follow car. Everybody was okay. They went to the My, hospital. Michael was, Michael was okay as well. Well, he, he was thrown off his bike. Yes, um, I believe so, but in any case, he could not continue, so bummer for him, so thankful that everybody was okay, um, that's an awful way to, to, um, to end the race, but it could have been so much worse, and then also, I just now remember that you told me on the phone today, as I was biking home, that the rider... Um, why don't you, why don't you okay. Swiss rider? Swiss rider. I don't know which Actually, rider it is. He, he's kind of towards the back of the race. He hit a cattle guard and Early I guess, guess kind of like railroad tracks, if you get your wheel caught up in there and it just throws you forward. It, it sounds like he's in intensive care right now, so he must have hit his head hard. Um, hoping that he is okay, first of all, and then... If he is okay, if he can continue on, that'd be great. But obviously, we just hope that he is um, all better. And then Ray. And then Ray. Oh, yeah, Ray. Ray Brown from Georgia has been doing well. Um, I'm trying to... It's a little bit confusing here. <laughs> 
this is a big bunch. These that just mm -hmm. tells you They're how really close together. close together up to here. But then things have started to. There's still a core group here. Um, the dark green is Eric, and then Ray is the light. Blue right here, you can see it right there. So they're pretty close together. Two Georgians go south. Um, I don't know, I think that's about it. I really hope that um, that that Swiss writer is okay. And then, at this point, at this point, what is it like? It's just like mind over mind. Right? Yeah, we're getting to Kansas. So the thing about the thing about Kansas for me is it started out with a nice tailwind. I was on Michael Hodger's TT bike and was just flying. Um, so that was a good distraction. I remember, it was still so stinking hot though, and I don't think I've had to deal with that quite as much this year. But it was in the 90s again. Um, in Colorado, it got cold a little bit at night, but then it blew up into the 90s again when we were coming into Trinidad and then uh, I, it was kind of later in the day when I made it to e uh, eastern Colorado. I think I took a short sleep stop and then that sunrise, we got the picture of the sunrise with the silo um, as I was crossing over into Kansas that next morning. But was, the wind was already blowing. I had a nice tailwind for a while and then it turned into a crosswind and it was... Um, it was hard. I was sleepy. I was very sleepy. But I think at this point, you're starting to just have to press on. Yeah. Just kind of do whatever you have to do to convince yourself yeah. to keep riding as things are starting to feel yeah. a little worse. You're getting more tired. And yeah. It's just it's just mind over matter. And it's just the crew keeping pushing yeah. you. Was this forward. where was this where we had the Red Bull fun, or was that Missouri? <laughs> that was Missouri. Okay, we'll save, save that. that for later. Save that for tomorrow. I had a Red Bull this afternoon. It was awesome. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, is that why? Is that why you're like this and I'm ready to go to bed? That explains it. Um, I, was, I was actually, Luke, if Luke is watching this, you'll appreciate this. I was just thinking that I should tell Brian that he should not drink any more Red Bull except in extreme cases of, like, dire necessity so we can c conserve the effect that it has on you. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. All right. Well, I think we're going to say good night for tonight and look forward to we're going to ride all night tonight. So we'll see where everybody is in the morning. We'll um, give an update tomorrow. We'll give an update yeah, sometime tomorrow. All right. Thanks. Bye. Leave comments in the uh, wherever we share this. Just I would say like and subscribe. <laughs> yeah, no, no. Leave some comments. And so if you have any questions or anything you want to talk about in the next video, it would be great. All right. Bye, y'all.